President Trump was a major highlight of the matchup between Alabama and LSU over the weekend. WVTM 13's Chip Scarborough takes a look at what it was like for first responders preparing for the president's visit. President Donald Trump was greeted with a warm round of applause at Bryant-Denny Stadium on Saturday, a visit Tuscaloosa City leaders and first responders spent nearly a week preparing for. I was in 10 meetings throughout the week. Uh, I had deputy chiefs and other personnel in additional meetings, so it was quite a very busy week. The fire chief says the main goal was to assist the Secret Service. That included being ready to help with any scenario that could happen while the president was in town. We uh, placed two rescue trucks in the, uh, in the motorcade, and we also had an uh, ALS uh, trauma surgeon in the procession with us in a, uh, from Birmingham Emergency Medical Services. So the chief says the process of preparing for the president's visit was pretty complex. He says it involves searching the entire route between the airport and when he got right here to Bryant-Denny Stadium. We did provide some blockering units, uh, reserve apparatus that helped block intersections. Chief Smith says in the middle of all the excitement, he had a chance to actually chat with the president who ended up staying for most of the fourth quarter. He was really excited. I think he hated to leave so early but uh, I think he wanted to get out before the traffic, so he didn't mess up traffic too bad. A visit the chief says went off without a hitch. In Tuscaloosa, Chip Scarborough, WBTM 13.